Let's talk about benign epilepsy with centrotemporal spikes, or BECS. So this is a benign epilepsy of childhood. The cause is unknown, and the peak incidence is between 7 to 9 years old. Now the peak incidence is very important because when asking questions about which epilepsy syndrome is this, the age of onset will be able to help you differentiate uh, which specific epilepsy syndrome the question is asking about. So the child will be developmentally normal and they will have focal seizures that are mostly occurring at night or when waking up. Status epilepticus is rarely present for these seizures and the main symptoms can be facial twitching on one side, uh, foot vocalizations, drooling, and speech arrest. For diagnosis, you'll see sharp waves in the centrotemporal region on the EEG with a normal background. There will also be a normal neurologic exam and a normal uh, MRI brain. So when we talk about the centrotemporal spikes, you can see them uh, at the T3 or T4 region. For treatment, antiepileptics are often not needed, especially if these seizures do not impair consciousness. However, if using antiepileptics, most of the antiepileptics that treat focal seizures will work but you'll want to avoid carbamazepine, phenobarbital, and lamotrigine. These can exacerbate the seizures. For prognosis, the epilepsy tends to last around two years, and it will resolve uh, almost always by age 13 years.